Welcome to Fentanyl Travel Horizon, a channel for uh, travel enthusiasts. This uh, winter autumn of 2020 is uh, the start of a great adventure down in Europe, regardless of uh, any restrictions and the quarantines and so forth, with, an, uh, with a uh, recreational vehicle or a house camper. You can always quarantine safely. Just fill up with food and you're set. So uh, I just bought this RV, or no RV, a house camper. And I've had it in for two services, oils, uh, belts, and brake fluid. Very important, brake fluid. Uh, otherwise uh, I could uh, risk uh, flying across a train crossing at high speed so in a week's time the plan is to go to Denmark Germany France and hopefully get through to Spain if they don't have the perimeter controls in that week otherwise I will have to skirt around uh, the south of France to get away from Swedish winters, which I've experienced for the last 41 years, and I don't want to experience it at the end. I've been so environmentally sensitive, so I've never traveled that much. I've only traveled two times to warmer climates. So I've uh, got a good carbon footprint in a life cycle perspective. But now it's going to change. It's going to camp around in a Fent Fiat Ducato from 1997 with all the amenities I need. I've renovated the uh, shower compartment which has had the classical broken floor due to uh, yeah, all the manufacturers uh, cheapness instead of having a proper glass fiber they have they uh, in these periods from yeah I think it's 80s 70s 80s when uh, campers uh, started taking off to 2000 at least uh, they put in cheap floor on top of uh, figulate uh, cell cell plastic insulation plastic so you always uh, have uh, cracks which has to be filled in or replaced. So now I took uh, epoxy and uh, smoothed it out and said let's see if it uh, will uh, survive the winter travels. Uh, on the list to do is a solar heater, solar water heater, so I can shower for cheap without having to go into towns and so forth. Uh, there are different tutorials on the internet uh, on how to do that. Uh, yeah. Black PVC pipe is a, a good suggestion with the hose and pipe fittings uh, which you fill up with water and then as it heats during the day it gets pressurized and you can adjust with a, yeah, a normal 12, uh, gate, uh, 12 volt uh, uh, air pump for which you can use to inflate tires. Uh, or you can just take a bucket uh, a black bucket, fill it with water and uh, put a lid on it and then use gravity to shower in it. Uh, this uh, camper, ha the house camper has the uh, railing on it so I'm going to fit some sort of... Uh, I'm going to rig up some sort of uh, drape for showering somehow I don't know the, the, the roof is rather uh, high up but I, I think it's gonna work out uh, and then I'm going to adjust the uh, solar cell system because the previous owner has installed solar cells but has not installed a regulator so it goes straight to the battery which kills it uh, in the middle of summer so I'm amazed it's uh, held up so far or it perhaps hasn't so it has had to change the battery because it's gone dead you know, from overcharging so that's the plans for this channel I'm gonna do some videos of uh, my travels 
the plan is to drive across Europe, uh, check out the uh, different uh, parkings and so forth that are uh, marked on uh, a Swedish site, Hellspaceklubben's uh, forum. They're, they have a map for uh, where the members have put uh, different uh, resting areas and refilling areas and empty areas for campers. Uh, mostly Germany, France, uh, Western Europe, let's say, old Western Europe. Uh, much less so in uh, Poland, there's just one road or two that's marked and nothing uh, further south. Czech Republic, almost nothing and absolutely nothing down on in former Yugoslavia. Uh, and then hopefully I will check out the old uh, uh, Cathar uh, Roussillon, uh, Languedoc, uh, Languedoc and these areas. If I'm lucky, I'm aiming to go down to south of Spain. Uh, and depending on the climate, I, I hopefully can get over the Pyrenees before it gets snowy there. Uh, because I don't have winter tires and I don't have uh, chains. Uh, and uh, then I'm going to uh, put... It'll bring a uh, class one EU moped, a derby or a Riejo or some of these Sp Spanish brands to uh, use it to excursions down to beaches and so forth. So I can park further inland where it's cheap or free, uh, set up base and then drive out to the beaches and uh, different uh, sightseeing sites. Uh, I have an electric um, scooter but there's only a maximum 60 kilometer range and I'm not sure if I'm gonna have electricity to plug into so it's better to buy a uh, gasoline and sco and, you know, scooter or uh, cross uh, moped where I have at least 200 kilometers in a tank uh, as they're really cheap on uh, gas but now I'm uh, back home to park and prepare for the travels and I will uh, post new videos later. Bye.